Hi, I'm John Swinconic with the Shrewsbury Daily Voice, and this is your weekly news. Your water bill will be going up. Selectmen on Tuesday approved a rate increase that was drafted by town manager Daniel Morgado. The median water bill for residents will go from $14 to $16 a year. Commercial and municipal rates will also be higher. Read more on the rate increase and post your opinion on the Shrewsbury Daily Voice. Daniel Morgado will continue to be the town manager for another three years. Selectman approved Morgado's contract Tuesday after a glowing evaluation by the board. Morgado was praised for making good financial decisions in tough times. For more, see the Shrewsbury Daily Voice. A case involving prostitution at a Shrewsbury hotel will be tried in Worcester Superior Court. According to court records, Marlboro resident Anthony Manis had been charged with trafficking a person for sexual servitude and with deriving services from prostitution. According to state police, Manis allegedly trafficked across New England. However, police reports indicate that most of it happened at the Shrewsbury Days Inn. Manis is being held because he didn't post $50,000 in bail. See the Shrewsbury Daily Voice for more details. The school board is starting a capital campaign. To do that, they voted to hire a campaign director. Superintendent Joe Sawyer said the director will be a full-time position with a $65,000 to $85,000 salary. The school district is expecting a $4.5 million budget increase this year. That would help reinstate teaching positions and administrative positions cut in the previous budget. The district is also facing a $2.5 million budget gap over the next five years. A public meeting on the budget will be held on October 24th at Oak Middle School. For more, see the Shrewsbury Daily Voice. Bullying in schools is on the decline. Reports of bullying last year were down by half compared to the year before. Some school board members are worried that the number of bullying allegations are much higher than what the district says are actual bullying incidents. Read more on the Shrewsbury Daily Voice. In sports, the Colonials varsity football team won its home opener. Shrewsbury defeated Doherty 30-27 after overcoming a 10-point deficit in the fourth quarter. The game was held on Saturday afternoon rather than Friday night. There are no evening school activities because health officials are worried about the triple E virus. Shrewsbury will play at Fitchburg on Friday. For more varsity sports coverage, check out the Shrewsbury Daily Voice. Finally, the library is saying goodbye to Linda Dashna. She is retiring after 14 years as head children's librarian. Dashna is known for expanding and enhancing children's programs. An open house will be held at the library between 3 and 6 on Friday, so the public can say their farewells. For more, check out the Shrewsbury Daily Voice. This has been your weekly news. For more on these stories, go to shrewsbury.dailyvoice.com. I'm John Swinconic, and I'll be at the Spirit of Shrewsbury Fall Festival this weekend, and so will Shrewsbury Media Connection. We hope to see you there. Have a great week.